silent gratitude isn't much use to anyone. So I'm shouting high and proud to thank you, dear family and friends. First, I want to thank Mama. Because of my mother, I am what I am today. My mother was someone who made an effort beyond doubt. Someone who always saw the good in others. Thank you to Papa for teaching me humility, to stay on my roots, to be humble at all times, and to be generous at all costs. I thank Tita Tess and Tito Ed for being my proxy parents here in Australia. I wouldn't be here without you. I thank my siblings. Especially my sister Portia for being my rock. The tough cookie who seems to absorb my woes like a sponge. Thank you, Baram, for being with me for 20-something years. We are one, as you always say. Thank you for giving me two beautiful children. Thank you, Jomi and Chet, for making me a mom. A very proud mom. You taught me to be creative, to be passionate in life, and to be present at all times. I'm excited of the future because of you. Thank you to my beautiful in-laws, to my Persian family and friends, for accepting me to be a part of your family, for being there in times of need, and for helping me raise my children all these years. Thank you to my cousins and childhood friends, the people that I played with when I, I was a child, wove plans with, and dreamed of the future with favorable patterns. They are treasured friends to last a lifetime. They continuously make Mama's memories always alive. Thank you to the Philippine Dance Ensemble, Bailas International, and PLCAA for satisfying one of my purposes in life, to be a volunteer. For giving me a chance to share my dancing skills to raise funds through many events and to give to the needy. Because volunteers do not necessarily have the time, they just have the heart. Thank you for making me a better dancer, for making me part of a group, for inspiring me to be fit and happy. Thank you for encouraging me to dress up, to love myself, to socialize and to enjoy my youth, to make me believe that there's no such thing as old there is just me on how I feel as I am. Thank you, friends and family, for donating and asking me to be a part of the causes close to my heart, the Breast Cancer Institute, and over the years, you've given solar lamps for Papa's hometown, sponsored medical missions, and by library for my hometown. Because of you, I always believe in humanity. Thank you, family and friends, for traveling with me, for seeing the world with me, for feeding my fearlessness and my love for adventure. I'm looking forward for more and more and more oceans to cross. Thank you for all the Christmases, Easter's, Halloween's, birthdays, weddings, for choosing to be with me and my family on those special occasions. Thank you, Baram, and to my Indian friends for introducing India to me. Experiencing India is like opening another chamber in my heart, 
a chamber that craves for your food, yoga and architecture. You're proof that religion and culture are not barriers for true friendship. Thank you for being my inspiration, for giving me shoulders to cry on, and for the gift of family and friendship that no amount of money nor dinner parties can buy. Because of you, I see the dawn of light every day. Now to say that we've been busy would be an understatement, but I'm joyful for all the time I spent with you. Not only that you lifted me higher, but now I know the sky is my only limit, perhaps for 45 more years or so. Thank you. Gracias. <laughs>